here we've got the Millennium Falcon cockpit. It's incredible to see in person. It's made up of over 200,000 Lego bricks um, and it took uh, well over 200 hours uh, to build. It's one of a kind, so it's the only one that exists in the entire world and it was first premiered at the Han Solo film. Hi again, my, my name is Michael Lee Stockwell, I'm a designer at uh, LEGO and what I do is uh, build fantastic spaceships for kids and the young at heart. So uh, this is an example of uh, one of the ships that I've uh, worked on recently for our 20th anniversary. If you're a Star Wars fan you'll recognize this is the very iconic Slave One, the ship that uh, Boba Fett, uh, the most iconic bounty hunter in the Star Wars universe that he flies. So that's what that looks like. And if we talk a, a little bit about the features of the ship, because uh, the ship actually flies in this direction and lands like this, when we uh, test these uh, products with children, we find out how they hold the product while they play with it. And we found out that when they wanted to hold the product and fly around the room with the product like this, with the ship, then there's two missiles right here, have triggers on the back. They found that difficult to hold. So I built a handle into the back folds out like this, so you can actually hold on to the ship, fly it, trigger the missiles from the back here. So, And then the uh, wings rotate with gravity as well as the seat for Bubba Fett. There's a compartment in the back to hide uh, Han Solo in carbonite brick. So great, lots of pl playability for, for the kids and, uh, and Star Wars fans to relive those fantastic film moments.